I am super nerdy and I have a lot of really nerdy tattoos. You know, I've got like a dinosaur fossil on my arm. And my most recent tattoo is down my ribs here. And it's a quote from Carl Sagan. And it says, we are a way for the cosmos to know itself. And that really resonates with me because my personal interpretation of what Carl was trying to say is that because there is no greater consciousness, because there is no God, no cosmic consciousness, no you know, pseudo-scientific energy source that's running around that can think for itself. You know, since we are made of the same stuff, the same molecules that were created, you know, in the explosions of the stars, and we ourselves have evolved this incredible ability to contemplate our place in the universe, since we can contemplate ourselves and we are made of the stuff of the cosmos by transitive properties we are a way for the cosmos to know itself because without us it can't know itself and of course that that puts us in this very special position and I'm not saying we're the only ones there there may be other forms of intelligent life that we haven't come across that we don't even know about there may be whole civilizations that have risen and fallen but those of us with that very special gift I think should respect it because, um, because there's, there's so much beauty out there that doesn't have the gift to, to contemplate itself. And since we can, I think that, um, that we should really honor that and, and really reflect on our place in the cosmos in a, in a reverent way. And that doesn't mean believing in God. It means really trying to understand the science.